All right, Cal Root Peg and Wife, the lost RVers, dream big, drive hard. We're going to do an important unboxing. We're going to courtside in three days. So I went ahead. I went ahead and got these. These are electronic tank sensors that we're going to put on right now. First thing we have to do is take off the tanks. We'll be back. Okay, that was easy enough, huh? Just quick release right here. There's tank A and there's tank B. These come with, with two. You can have as many as you want. And I thought I was ordering uh, the model that gave you the little indicator that you put up in the RV, but apparently I didn't. But it has a free app that you put on your phone and it will tell you exactly, supposedly, how much gas is left. So let's go do that. Be right back. Okay, so she's trying to figure out how to download the app. And on this one, I put the four little legs on. One, two, three, four. Although we may not be able to need them because there is an inset there. But we're going ahead. And this is what it looks like here. So you take this little yellow tag off. I'll wake it up. Wait, and then, wait, 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 then you put a bead side. This is a little grease to make a better contact with this is the sensor right here. So. You go like that, and then I guess you just flip it on over, put the sensor in the center, and then hit this button, one, two, three, four, five, right? To wake it up, yeah. Five times, and that should wake them up. And as soon as she downloads that app, we'll be able to tell if we have propane or not. All right, so we did one. Very easy to do. Should have done it at the propane's place because I know this tank here is probably half filled. But we'll, we'll run with what we have. So we'll be right back. Mo Pika. See ya. Your devices have been well, added. we got the tanks back on with the devices underneath it. Now we're trying to figure out the app. Instruction page. Download, trying to figure download. out the, the app. standard sensor right. battery placement I I don't know where to of course it's not going to be easy right so anyway this is Cal Root Pig and Wife the lost RVers trim big and drive hard we're leaving in three days see ya all right so we got something going we got 65 and 1 and 100% of the other. Now, what you have to do is go in and go to a 30 pound tank, which or we have. 20 to 30 pound, yeah. Here's the settings. And when we were at 20, it showed 100% full. We went to 30 pounds and it showed 65% full on one. And 100% full. I don't want to be full. notified. We'll do it every right. Do Once it. a day. No, but do it more right now. So we can see what's going on. Well, every 12 hours? This is just setting it, okay, every six yeah, hours. There you go. Now so they'll tank notify. size still 20%. So hit that to 30, 20 pounds. 20 pounds right Oh, 30. why did it. There we go. Okay, now go back. 30%. Okay, that's one. What's the other one? And that's 67%. That's very Now, is it worth filling up or no? Mm, I say, for, yeah, we're good. So, we got a so that's it. That's the Mopika. Is that what it's called? Yeah, Mopika. Electronic tank Sensor. sensors. Now, for whatever reason, of course, it's me. So it just, that's the way life is. I can only pick up one sensor on my phone. But we'll see what's going to happen. So there it is. An unboxing of a Mupika electronic sensor, sensor for your LPG tank. tanks and 
so far on her phone it works great we'll put this all back together and start loading this thing up with food and stuff i think we should go over to dollar tree and just get all the cabinet stuff anyway you guys all right. lost rvers bidding you adieu bye